Hello friend and welcome you to Cassidy, Cassidy tutorial with programming. So here I'm going to show you how you upload image in Java or JSP. So before you before we you upload you need to create a table. So in my case I have created a table with this uh, ID and photo. So for ID I declare a data type uh, integer and for photo I created medium text so after you create this table then you need to create this form so in this form first let me explain you Bef uh, after you create this form so <coughs> in here so this is this is my form name from here from here to here so <coughs> let me close this form so this is my form name so this file and you need to add with this encrypt type so if you didn't uh, add this it will not take the file when you upload so here <coughs> this is my file then this is my button when I click this then the photo will go to directory then the part will go to database so here in this video I'm going to teach you how to upload this photo in directory so in next video I'll teach you how to upload the entire image in the database so here let me explain you step by step so after I create this form I create another form that is safe so from this JSP, this is my action. So here, here is the, this is parameter I pass into this save. So in this save, you need to, you need to add this jar in the library. So if you don't have this jar, I'll show you how to download. Okay, when you type this jar, if this jar is not available in the library, then it will show like this. So. To download this, you need to copy from here to here, then Ctrl C. After you type, then paste it here. Then is you need to download from this Java that to come is always work. So you need to click here, then download. So in my case, I already download, and I'll show you. I save it in desktop. So here is the jar file. So let me paste in this folder so here i'll ex extract here so this is my jar file after i extract then i will add in i'll right click in library add jar folder so i'll go in my desktop so in this folder so i add this jar so when you, once you add this then it will not show that error message otherwise it will show that error message so the, what is the main thing you have to download this three jar one is this command file upload and one is this <coughs> command you done output so this three jar you need to download i hope this mysql that you already you have this so no need to download if you are not available in your pc also you can download by doing this you can <coughs> download my sql jar so this i import my sql jar so this is the part where i save the image so here is important i will show you what to do here so once you create this uh, one folder photo then right click in this folder go to properties then in here here this is three dot available here then click it here when you click it double click here then Control c once you control c then go here then paste it here so when you paste it will become red color because why you need to change this to front slice all this backslash change it to front slice so let me change one by one nah. so so this is the file size up to 8 GB I can upload the image or if you want more then you can increase this files, file size 
so let me do one so from here i pass that uh, image name i pass it here so this my a jdbc that query i get this from this is my database bus booking then this is my username and this is my password in database so this is no use i'm removing so you need to write with this statement all right if you didn't get this code also you can see this this code properly so you need to once you create this then this file so you can import with this java.util.enumeration so this this multipart this multipart it came from this jar file from this cost jar file so after you complete this code so i pass the file name this file name is came from here it means that the name of the photo I upload so after that okay I'll allow you to write this code after you write this code so I'll give you a time and then you write this code also this will be redirect to that upload form with message it's successful of loan and here it, if it's not successful then fail to upload it will it will show this message so how i got this message i'll show you in this index form i pass this string message if message is not equal to null then it will show this if it null then it will not show anything so friend let me try to upload so i'll run this index form so i'll browse which photo so i'll upload this one click submit wow successful upload so let view this image see this image is coming here with the id one so let try another one let me back let me try this image click submit successful view here is two with this is with id two then let's check in our database it save the part or not select star from and select star from my photo yes it's safe so how i display i'll show you in display form you need to write this query and with, you need to import this mysql then you need to write this query so this is my column one this is my column two so select start from photo or you can select from that particular column then after that you need to pass this so how you can do like this also you can take this image link then browse where is the image is available then take one then click ok then you need to remove this otherwise it will show only this particular image then you need to open this expression tag then you can write this here so here it will show the image so in my case i display with id and with this image and the image i pass here this is photo is the part this is folder part so friend i hope this video will help you for future developing any website so if you like this video so please don't forget to subscribe so thank you so in next video i promise i'll show you how to upload this entire photo not by using pad we'll save the entire photo in database so thanks you.